publishing is going increasingly digital places like, of course, a newsstand, uh, which is uh, Apple's, but also uh, there's another one. This trend is continuing uh, with the emergence of platforms, well, like here's another one, a digital magazine store called Magster. It's New York based. It puts magazines online across multiple platforms, including Android, also Windows devices, and has recently signed on 20 major American titles, bringing the total magazines on offer to about 2,000. Tell us more. Girish Ramdas joins us, co-founder and also CEO of uh, Magster, around the desk with us here at the SGX. So this is pretty cool. 2,000 titles from, uh, from uh, mainly American or from all around uh, the world? From more than 30 countries at this point. Wow. And uh, it's, we, we have magazines ranging from like uh, large consumer magazines to like small niche uh, publications. Interesting, okay. And uh, the business model here, uh, you and I were talking offline a couple of seconds ago and I asked you, look, on average, how much, how much cheaper is it? To uh, to get it from Magster than it is to get a you know a, a paper subscription. Sure. You said on average half, yeah, fifty percent less. Yeah, and some magazines more than ninety percent off. Wow. Then how do you make money? Yeah, I think the volumes right now are small, but then as it keeps expanding and the number of uh, digital uh, tablets out there in the market is like uh, expanding and exploding. So that's where we'll make money on the numbers. Okay. And what kind of cut do you take? Uh, we make about 25 to 35 percent of the top. Wow. Okay, Bilo. Thanks, Mart. Uh, Girish, uh, I don't. Okay, suppose I was a publisher, and you call me and you tell me why I should uh, do business with you. Uh, wouldn't I rather fundamentally stand alone and have people come to me if they like my product rather than go to you because you're going to pit me against my competitors all in the same platform? Uh, no, in the traditional world, if you see, uh, Bernie, everything's in a shop. You don't have standalone stores for magazines. So in the digital world, it's kind of the same thing. So uh, we, we've just replicated that model and made it more interactive, more engaging. And so it, uh, the entire technology platform comes to the publisher free of cost, and they just make their magazines available, and we sell it for them. So are they making up for volume when they're selling it on tablets, the magazine publishers, um, what they're losing by in, in terms of price? Because if they're 50% cheaper on a tablet... Uh, I think it's a little different, because in print, uh, you have the cost of printing, distribution, circulation. True. That's kind of huge. So uh, in, in digital, you don't have that problem. Are traditional right. magazines and newspapers, sorry, sorry, That's traditional magazines and newspapers, are they, are they dead? How much longer do they have left? <laughs> That's a good question. I think maybe f 10 years, five to 10 years. Any plans to go public? Uh, not at this point. We're still in the growth stage, so we're looking to raise another $10 million in funding, go to the next level, and then there's a good opportunity for that. You're okay. competing with Newstand, right? Uh, we're not really competing. We've kind of co-opted Apple Newsstand and Google and all of them as, though they would be competitors, we've co-opted them as points of sale. So we also on the fly create apps for those magazines in the mm. Apple Newsstand. So nearly, oh. uh, so out of the 4,000 mm. odd magazines on Apple Newsstand, nearly six, 700 are powered by Magster at this point. Very wow. cool too how the uh, online magazines get the models to film a greeting to the people <laughs> who are looking at it on your platform. Things are just changing so quickly. Thank you for joining us. Great story. Thank um, we're going to say goodbye to Bernie over in Hong Kong right now. He's going to go prep for some other shows that he's working on, namely The Call. And also we have to say goodbye to our guest, Garesh Ramdas, the co-founder and CEO of Megster. We're going for a quick break. We'll be back in two minutes. Stay with us.